Hey guys, how's it going today? We are going to be playing some more Xbox 360 Minecraft, or oops, sorry, uh, bleh, Minecraft Xbox 360 edition. So, uh, since I recorded last, I made up a big long list of objectives for me to do in this, and um, I actually planted the jungle sapling. I figure right here, down in here, I'll clear out this area a little bit more. This will be where I'll have my pens right behind my house. Uh, obviously I have my sugarcane farm over there, I've got the farms in the village over there, over there, and uh, so then I'll have this cow down in there, I'll get some pigs, some sheep, some chickens and stuff. Uh, I still have no idea what's going on with that floating mountain over there. But uh, yeah, we have the majority of the stuff that we need to begin doing this. some of the stuff right now. So I'll get some of the easier stuff out of the way, and then there's going to be some more difficult stuff, and once I finish those, I don't know. Uh, I might end the series, I might continue playing, see what else happens, I might just start playing with somebody else with maybe the same goals or stuff like that. So I've got a list here of the goals that I made up. Um, so I have to, here I have, I have to make up five different potions. Uh, I have to start growing pumpkins and cocoa, which is why I planted the tree. I also have the uh, the pumpkins, which I will be doing the majority of like the planting and getting all the food and the farming and stuff before I go into like the other stuff. So then uh, I have to get like a steady supply of food of melons, stews, cookies, pumpkin, pie, cake. Uh, I need to get a full set of diamond armor. I need to maximum enchant a diamond sword, which is 30. I need to enchant using an anvil and a book, so I have to find a cave and get one of the enchanting books. I need to defeat the end dragon, of course, so that's that's probably going to be the one that I end at, but I have got some like other random ones here. I want to create a zen room with carpet, potted plants, pictures, juice, jukebox, like all sorts of different stuff that I can make that I usually wouldn't do and stuff. I want to build an entire furnace just to burn it down. Henry's here with me. Yeah, he likes the cows. Yes, that's a cow. Um, there's, there's the achievement for having a pig take fall damage, which I mentioned that I don't actually have yet. So I'm thinking I'll lead a pig up to, like, the mountain and then lead him off with a carrot or something. Make him take damage that way. Uh, I want to make a house out of, like, the different building materials. So I want to make one out of quartz, sandstone, stone, and bricks. Uh, I need to get, like, an ender chest and set up that and all sorts of stuff like that. And then I want to get certain items as well. So I, I need to get a block of gold diamond, lapis, and of emerald, and that's basically all I've come up with right now. If I come up with anything later, we'll go ahead and do those as well, but I'm, I've wasted the majority of the day. I probably should have paused or something, uh, but we've wasted the majority of the day here. So, the first thing I want to do is get all of the, of the food going. Uh, I don't believe I have any melon seeds. No, I do not, but we'll go ahead and get these pumpkin seeds going. I'm trying to think if there was anything else I really needed. Set away the actual pumpkins, cobblestone, spider eye, gunpowder string, we'll get rid of that. I don't need the carrot on me at the moment. I don't think, yeah, I have my, my good pork chops, so we'll go ahead and set those down. And yeah, yeah, you need to not stand in front of the TV while I'm recording, please. Okay, so we've got the farm over there. I've got the farm for weeds, carrots, potatoes, and stuff over here. I'm going to need a pumpkin and a melon farm, so I figure I'll take this island. I'll turn half of it into a pumpkin farm, half of it into a melon farm. Yes, there's cows. No, I'm not going to kill them. Got to go back and make a hoe real quick. Still got plenty of iron. Some people might argue that it's not a very good idea to use the iron for that. But I kind of like farming. Like I said, I do quite a bit of farming, so there shouldn't be too much problem with doing that. So get over here. We'll turn half of the island into... Cows. Yes, there's cows. I should leave that like that, and we'll... Clear off a bit of an area for me to walk here. Put the pumpkins on this side, and then that piece of dirt will be to remind me that the melons are on that side. Do I have a shovel?
Alright, so sorry about that. I had to go change my brother's bed real quick. So this side will end up being pumpkins, the other side will be melons, we'll get the cocoa and everything, we'll get like all of my... The goal is to make it so that the food is sustainable, so if I went with a specific food source I would have plenty of it. So we're going to need lots of cows, lots of pigs, lots of chickens. Luckily you can't kill sheep and get food. So that will be the primary goal for now, it'll probably take a few episodes to get everything up and going and then after we have all that the we'll have to get the cows get some milk chickens for the eggs and everything so we'll be able to make cakes and cookies and pumpkin pies and all sorts of stuff and then after we have all of the food and everything we can go for the uh, the nether and I forget, there was there was a challenge that was specific to the nether, the potions. So we need to go to the nether, get the potions and everything. Hopefully by that time we'll have an anvil, we'll have some stuff enchanted. With that, I don't know if we'll end up getting a level 30 enchantment by the time we get to the nether, because I usually don't have a pickaxe by that time. But we'll end up doing that anyway. We can burn down a forest before that happens. There are a few things that we can do before that, but... There's not too much after that. I have enough to go mining. So I suppose what we'll do is we'll go uh, we'll go dig up some stuff. What's down here? And this goes nowhere, but it does have iron. So we'll go ahead and pick that up. So we got some iron. I would like to actually have a cave that's easily accessible. How about this one? This one good? Looks like it goes down, so this cave might be the one that we'll be using for the majority of our uh, cave exploring, dungeon crawling. So that's what one of the things we have to do is we have to find a spawner. Make sure everything is safe here first. Alright, we're good there. So we can just dig straight down now. Okay, that did not work. But, uh, oh hi, Mr. Skeleton, you will not spawn there again. I know you and your skeleton ways. Bastard. You're in with that Enderman that knocked me off the cliff. Hey, don't don't think I forgot about that. That was, was scary as hell. It's not very often when I'm playing Minecraft I actually know that I'm going to die. And once I've got to that point of, yep, I'm going to die, it's very rare that I ever do actually live. Dang it. Freaking Dysgraphia. You know, whenever I mess up, I just blame it on the Dysgraphia. Because I can. The only joy of having a disorder is that you can blame everything on that. Plus the uh, the brand new controller that I got for Christmas, I've been using so much it's desensitized by now. So I have to push very hard to move everything around. I think what we might want to do is trade with the uh, the villagers. I don't know if they ever have anything ridiculously useful or stuff that might kind of help me cheat a little bit. Like uh, maybe if one has, I don't know, like blaze powder or something like that, blaze rot would be better. Or maybe something really cool. Let's go find a cave. Hello, Mr. Sheep. I think I've already been this way. Looking for a cave, at least. Anything over here? Oh, that was good. He blew up. Did not, I 
didn't even do damage to me. Alright, let's get some torches. Does it just go around in a circle? <laughs> I am having the worst luck with finding a cave. Worst case scenario, I have to make a manual cave, which actually wouldn't be that bad because I need cobblestone for the, uh, the pastures that I'm going to have for the cows and the chickens and the pigs. Get all the dirt that's around here, might as well. Wait, do I have a full stack of dirt? Yes, I do. I'm wondering where I started filling up my hot bar. Is there anything over here? No, it's just water. Fantastic. Hi, Mr. Cow. Would you like to be murdered for entertainment purposes? Sure. No, nope, nothing over here. Need to find a cave, a cave, a cave. Worst case scenario, I have to just do the finding a cave off camera. Because if it's going to keep being like this, I might have to wait until another episode to actually be in a cave. Well, does this go anywhere? Uh, it goes off over this way. I have a feeling it stops though, does it? Yay, it keeps going! Yes, 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 I know, skeleton. Oh, there's one there too. Okay, this is not good. Not good. Not good, not good, not good, not good. Not good. No! Oh, Jesus! Oh, Jesus! Chill, chill, chill. Yes! Anybody else in shock right now? Ugh. And that's why people play on Peaceful. But I don't do that because Peaceful is not fun, and honestly, having stuff like that happen randomly while I'm digging is kind of entertaining. Oh, this, this doesn't stop, does it? Oh, please tell me this goes down farther. Oh, this can't be the end. That was a fantastic idea. <laughs> fantastic. I get murdered in a cave and it doesn't even go down. The worst luck at finding caves. <sighs> this is fantastic. This game hates me right now. This jelly of my skills has got to keep torturing me. Mr. Pig, does that cave go down? Looks like it goes down. Alright, now stay... Wait, um... Could you just, like, stay there forever and then wait till I get a saddle? That would be fantastic. Mr. Pig. You will be my most favorite of all... Most favoritist. If I'm talking in, like, kindergartner speak. But you stay there. And when I find a spawner and get a saddle, or if I find a, like, mine system and get a saddle, that would be great if you could just stay there and never, ever, 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 way too many evers there, but never move. I think he understands. We have a mutual agreement that he will die for my purposes of getting the achievement. I actually didn't realize it, but the uh, the guy that I always play as, I, I didn't have him set while I was playing before, but Randall Wayne, the guy that I always played as, was from Deadlight, and Deadlight was the game that came out free, and I thought that was kind of interesting that I had been playing as him for so long. No idea what the game was, and then I ended up getting the game. Here, just for when it gets night. You stay there, Piggy. Mr. Pig. I think we might end up getting that anvil uh, quite soon. 
And luckily that block of emerald won't be too hard to get because I'm in the village. So I think the main thing that they wanted to trade me was like wheat and paper. And the majority of the rest of them were just buying from them. Torch it up. I hear lots of zombies over here, so I think there might be a spawn. Yes, Henry zombies. I hear lots of zombies. And there's one. <laughs> Sounds like they're over here. Nope, that's a skeleton. Ooh, ooh, juked. Juked. Epic jukes. Let's go. Let's go, Mr. Skeleton. Bring it. Bring it. Walk through that door, I dare you. Oh, oh, oh. Ow, 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 ow. ow. Does doing this defend from damage? I think it does. That'll be useful the next time I'm ambushed by 20 skeletons and an enderman. <laughs> yeah, skeletons, ha 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 ha. Skeletons are no laughing matter, Henry. Never make fun of skeletons. They will mess you up. Hello, Mr. Spider. <laughs> What I do when I'm mining is I light up like a pretty... I light up like the large area before everything splits off and then I just mine each area individually and head back that way. I pretty much just go around in a clockwise or counterclockwise, whichever way I happen to be deciding to go direction. So now that I've gone this way, I'm going to work this entire side, like down that way. But I typically don't go straight down. I look around and mine some stuff. Oh, hello. Thank you for taking fall damage. Screw off, Mr. Creeper. It's like back in the village trying to save that villager. That's right, you're dead. Do they have an enchantment in this called Bane of Skeletons? I would totally put that on my sword right now. Skeletons, creepers, endermen that like chuck you off of cliffs. Hello. There's light down there. It looks like it's emanating from a block, but... I don't know. Still hear a lot of zombies. Sounds like they're behind me. Over this way. Oh look, gold! How deep am I? 30. I didn't know gold spawn this high. Alright, we'll deal with that later. Should probably make more than just 16 torches at a time. I use a lot of them. Okay, did not see you. Come here. Come here, don't you try to find a safe way down. You just die. You're a spider too. Let's not go this way, because that leads into a bottomless pit. I saw the bottom. Not that far. But I don't feel like taking fall damage right now. Never know when an enderman might be right around the corner. I hear something moving towards me. 
So it's on some dirt. It's up here. No, it's not. Where is it? I think it might be above me. Put some stuff here. Don't want anything spawning. We don't want anybody spawning while I'm near the lava. Oh, I'll take that bone, thank you. I may never find my way out of this. Here, let's get some of that down there. Right, light it up for me, please. I'll be right back. Gotta go explore some more. Did I come down this way? Apparently I didn't. There's a spider behind me. Oh, look, it's the gold. Okay. That's what it was. It was the light of the, uh, the lava reflecting off the gold. Ow. Skeletons surprising me. When we get out of here, I'll make some armor. Ooh, spawner. Is that it? No, it wasn't just spawner. Dang it! I thought it was like one of those little tiny flame things that comes off the side of spawners. Oh, we'll check back this way, and if there's nothing else, we can head back that way. Might as well start picking up this gold, since it is one of my objectives. I think one of those those guys wanted like three gold ingots or something like that. For one emerald, that might be useful. Don't have another use for it. At the moment, at least. Oh, <gasps> yes! Oh, yeah. That's right, I saw you, Lapis. Alright, let's get out of here. Got the Lapis. Let's go. This way out? Oh. Oh, look, there's iron. Let's go ahead and get up, grab some of this. It's a shame we can't find any diamonds. Yeah. Maybe if we could find, like, diamonds just, like, sitting below our feet and some gold, like, a few blocks away, that would be fantastic. That's the only thing that would have made finding that lapis any better. Because, oh, god, lapis. Oh, yeah, that's amazing. So, where do you guys think we could find some diamonds? I mean, it'd be amazing if, like, at any point we could just, like, look underneath. I saw those the whole time. None of you can, in you can, none of you, nope, nope. None of you can dispute that. I, I totally saw that. No, I'm joking. When I went, oh, it was because of the diamonds, and then I saw the lapis. I was like, oh, I can pass this off as me being retarded. What depth am I at? Fourteen. Right. So, I suppose we can go back that other way now, since it doesn't seem to be much over this way. Unless there's something down by where this lava runs. Uh, yeah, there's a skeleton by the lava. Let's, uh, get over here. Let me knock you into the lava. That's right. Burn. Alright, is there anything out this way? I need to rearrange my hotbar so that my torches, my pickaxe, and my sword are all adjacent. Let me do that real quick. Get some of this coal. Every bit gets me slightly closer to the uh, fully enchanted stuff. Anyway, I got two diamonds, so I can make an enchanting table if if I find like a chest or something that has obsidian in it. I don't know if the Xbox Minecraft does that, but I know you can find uh, obsidian in chests sometimes in the computer version. What else is up this way? Hello. More diamonds. I'm so glad we came up this way. Henry, you're... Don't hold jelly beans to my screen. Yeah, don't just... Don't hold jelly beans to my screen, please. Have we made any buckets yet? I don't think I have. It's this way. Ooh, lava. Yeah, even up here. It's still pretty deep. Alright, let's get these diamonds. Alright, 
How much iron do I have on me? Three. Uh, and I don't actually have my workbench with me. Okay. So now we can go and check back out this way, I believe it was. And the false spawner. We found a lava lake, which is very good for my purposes. I'm in a cave, and I do have just enough wood. Great. Only ten torches left as well. So, the reason this is good, I'm going to light this up here real quick. They got a little area for me. Workbench, plonk that down there. And we shall make a furnace, plonk that down there. We will toss in iron. Shoot. No, nope. get that back up there. Okay. Oh, I have four diamonds now. Oh, that's amazing. Yeah, I absolutely, completely forgot that I had. So let's go pick up this water that's back over this way. Is there anything else in here? Or is it just water? There's redstone. Oh, I'm so glad I came in here. And lapis as well. Oh, great. That'll be great. Because now I have the uh, lapis. Everybody knows that the blue is the best color to color stuff in this. So that's the color that I'm going to make like my carpet and stuff inside my zen room. I don't know why I'm thinking about that. That was like one of the final ones that I was going to do along with like burning down the forest and some other stuff. How much that? 21 lapis. Right, so I can dye a sheep that and I'll just have a blue sheep forever. Okay. And then I have my water bucket. Which, um. Go and light up up there. Let's get up there. Is there anything good up there? I'm waiting for my iron to smell. Hey! That's where you got the jelly beans from. That's my bag of candy. I had it open to me so I could, like, randomly while I was... Ow. I had it open so I could, like, eat some while I was playing and it would be kind of funny. But no, you decided to eat it. No, don't smack me. It's my candy. My, no, no, it's my, it's my candy. My candy. Quit tackling me. <laughs> She's trying to wrestle me for my candy. It's mine. Stop, I can't see. I'm below the screen, so it's got like a white glare on it. Stop, I'm recording. And I hear an Enderman. No, you're not recording. No, you're not recording. No, you're not. All right, Mr. Enderman, this is what you get. Oh, screw yourself. Oh. Uh, it's like the laziest swing ever. Meh. And I don't actually have enough wood for a torch now. Oh, I can see that, though. I can see clearly now the creeper's gone. I know you can't see. Henry, please be quiet. Oh, it goes down that way. Hmm. <sighs> Sucks that I didn't bring more wood. Anyway, now that I have iron, I can go ahead and... Might as well make two buckets since I'll be using them anyway. Get that there, that there. I don't need the stone axe. What I need is... Cobbly stone. There we go. I can just, yeah, I just destroyed my stepping stones. Either, oh well. I was gonna say either way, but for some reason that did not fit in that sentence. Wait, I do have a piece of flint on me, right? Yes, I'm not just kidding. You need to stop. 
No, I'm not kidding. Why are you tackling me again? <laughs> I'm being... <laughs> My three-year-old brother is trying to assert his dominance. Stop! You already hit me in the face with an apple today. He was like halfway through an apple and I told him he would stop throwing it because he threw it at my sister and it landed in like a basket of yarn. So I told him to be more careful and he goes, no, and he chucks it and it smacked me right in the eye. That's my chocolate bunny. My chocolate bunny. My chocolate bunny, yep. Alright, so get that cobblestone out of there. Couple buckets of lava. Bloop. Bloop. I don't know why, but for some reason, when I when I was playing this with one of my friends, I was like, "Okay, I'm gonna make a another portal real quick." And he goes, "You have diamonds?" And I go, "No." He had absolutely no idea that you can make another portal like this. Which is kind of sad, but not really all that surprising. I need a pork chop real quick. Alright, let's get some more lava. Put this. Shoot. Lock that off. This here. That. Yeah, I just want I want to make sure that the water doesn't flow out down there, which it probably wouldn't do from where I am, but I just want to take the chance anyway. See, this is where it'd be really helpful to have access to up there, but I don't anymore. Oh, that might actually do that. Let me plug that up real quick. Okay, so then that was three, which means the next one, the next ones would be up here. Oh yeah, I just realized you turned my light off. Why did you turn my light off, Henry? I know it's on now, but why did you ever turn it off? Yeah, it's on. Just leave it alone. I know it's on. You just turned it back on. I didn't even realize it was off. I was wondering why it was so dark in my room. Boom. Alright, so, um, shoot. Henry, what did you do with my pencil? Here it is. Alright, so coordinates are 3, 7, 3, 13, negative 2, 4, 3. Shoot. Alright, um, Actually, let's do this. Let's. I was gonna say let's make a chest, but I can't because I don't have enough wood. So if I lose everything in there, I'll have lost everything. So, uh, this is a dilemma. Do I go in with all my stuff and risk? Ah, screw it. We're going in. But that'll have to wait till next episode. So I'll see you guys then.